edges of a pie not only looks pretty, but it also helps the pastry and filling stay in place when cooking. Pies are generally made with a short crust pastry, and for best results, it is important to keep the pastry cool when rolling and shaping. First, dust your work surface and rolling pin with a little flour. Then start to roll the pastry. It's much easier to roll pastry if you take it out of the fridge at least 20 minutes before you need it. As you roll, keep turning the pastry 90 degrees. It will help you roll it evenly. When the pastry is about half a centimeter thick, cover the top of the pie and push down gently round the edge to seal. Pick up the pie and cut away the excess pastry with a small knife. Be careful not to cut away too much pastry as the top will shrink slightly during cooking. Your pie is now ready for crimping. The most classic crimp is a scalloped crimp. Use your index finger to push down on the edge of the pastry and use the finger and thumb of your other hand to pinch the pastry either side. Another crimp you could try is with a fork. Simply make indentations around the edge of the pie with the back of a fork or you could try using other kitchen utensils to create different effects. For something a little more impressive, make cuts at one and a half centimeter intervals around the edges of the pastry, then fold the tabs over each other at a 45 degree angle and push down to seal. Once you have finished crimping, brush your pie with egg wash and bake in a hot oven until golden brown and crispy.